All right, mathematicians, hello again, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to submit your project, your Desmos scene, how to submit it on Google Classroom, because it's a little bit tricky, and I want you to do everything right to make sure you get the best grade. First, you're going to be making a Google Doc for your project reflection. So you could just click, you know, blank Google Doc. I might just title it Desmos Project Reflection. And it's always good to put your name at the top. We'll put a little title in the center, Desmos Project Reflection. And then you're going to be writing one to two paragraphs uh, or more to answer the questions on your project sheet. But what I'd like you to do here is uh, recognize how to submit your project so that I can see your graph. So here, I want you to put in bold at the top, link to graph, and then colon. And then underneath, this is where you will write your actual reflection. So you need to actually give me the link to your graph so that I can see it. How do you do that? Well, you go back over to Desmos. This was our completed story. Um, you, you know, set your sliders however you'd like them. And you press save so that it's saved with the sliders in the correct position. But then to generate a link, you're going to go over here to the globe. Actually, I'm sorry, not the globe. This little button here, the share shape, where it says share your graph. And here it says share this link. So you can either highlight this link and press copy, or you can do com uh, command V or control V, sorry, control C, or command C for uh, copy. But I'm just going to press copy, go over to my Google Doc. I will press paste, and there we now have the link. If you press enter, it should hyperlink, and this is the link to your Desmos graph. If I share this and then click on this link, it will bring me directly to your Desmos graph so that I can view it and grade it. So this, ladies and gentlemen, is how to submit your Desmos project. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.